Hey guys, we're here with Captain Jesse at the Canadian International Air Show Media Day, Toronto Pearson. Uh, Captain Jesse, tell us a little bit about who you are. Absolutely, so I'm Captain Jesse Eggert Smith, my call sign's Moto. I'm the 2022 CF 18 demo pilot, and uh, I'll be flying this beautiful uh, F 18 uh, behind me uh, here at the Toronto, uh, at the uh, Canadian International Air Show here in Toronto. So, pretty cool. So, tell us a little about your history and how you got, when did you get involved in the military? How did you get to become a test, well, I don't know, a test pilot, but a demo pilot? Yeah, so uh, I joined the RCAF back in 2011. Uh, I went to the cadets originally and uh, got my glider license there. Uh, I've always wanted to fly, and so this was uh, a great way to, uh, to do that. Uh, I went to the Royal Altoria College, got my uh, degree back in 2015, been flying uh, since 2014 with the RCAF. Uh, been flying the F-18s here since 2018, and I'm currently based in uh, beautiful Cold Lake, Alberta. Beautiful. And tell us some stats on this uh, beautiful bird behind you. Okay, uh, well, it's uh, an all-weather uh, interceptor, multi-role fighter. Uh, it uh, can go up to Mach 1.8 in the configuration that we've got right here. Uh, it's got the APG-73 uh, Mexican radar in the front, probably the, the finest of the Mexicans ever built. Although we are going through some upgrades right now to, uh, to get APG-79s uh, installed on some of our jets. Uh, it can carry a whole range of uh, different payloads. Uh, from external fuel tanks to uh, air to ground weapons uh, to air to air missiles uh, all the way through. In fact, we got some missile rails on the side right over there for the AIM 9 Sidewinders for anybody who's uh, seen Top Gun before. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And uh, yeah, any other questions you got? Yeah, so, uh, so being part of the demo unit, where do you, which air shows do you fly in and which ones do you enjoy? So I've got the, uh, the great privilege of going across Canada and really North America this summer. Uh, so I've flown in uh, a whole series of, uh, of air shows from Abbotsford uh, to uh, Toronto now. I'll be off uh, in Gatineau and in, uh, in Mirabelle here shortly, London next week. And uh, I've actually flown a few down uh, in the States as well, down in, uh, in Michigan for a couple, and I'll be ending my season in Sacramento. Very good. Now, now, how long do you are you part of the demo team? Is it just one year gig or yeah, long? Yeah, so it's, it's a one and done for us. So uh, I came from a, a frontline fighter squadron, 401 Tactical Fighter Squadron, and I've got the uh, the privilege that after the season I get to uh, go back to a frontline fighter squadron, 433 Tac uh, Tactical Fighter Squadron, up in uh, Bagotville, Quebec. Very good. So you're stationed. You will be stationed in Quebec. Affirm. But right now you're out of Abbotsford. But well, right now I'm out of Cold Lake. Alberta. Cold Lake, Alberta. Yeah, Very exactly. good. They do a lot of training there in a Cold, Cold Lake, Alberta. It's a great training area. Now, for any uh, young uh, kids that want to uh, have a dream of getting in the Air Force, what would you recommend they do? Well, uh, I mean, it's a uh, it's a great job. I've loved uh, every minute of it. Uh, there's always uh, a lot of great resources online that you can look up at, uh, at forces.gc.ca uh, and uh, you can uh, try and figure out if it's a, it's a good fit for you. Uh, we're always looking for great people. Great. Thank you very much, brother. My pleasure. <laughs> great meeting you. Have a great show. I'm looking forward to it. Bye-bye.